Hey friends, it's Kip Icon, and welcome back to Kip Plays Kind Words, Lo-Fi Beats to Write To. Um, I played this yesterday, and it was a lot of fun. So let's dive back into it today. Maybe this would be something fun to do, like, every morning or something. Oh, someone sends their thanks for the letter you wrote, and... We got a new sticker! Pop can. Is that another pop can inside of it? What does that mean? Looks like there's just one. Someone sends their thanks for the letter you wrote and... Oh, we got another sticker! Trouser Fish. He would very much appreciate it if you turned the radio on and left it alone. <laughs> oh, someone sends their thanks for the letter you wrote and... Kitten Plunk. A kitten that flies and drops marbles. Cool. Well, we're collecting stickers at a good pace. Hey, look at that! Someone wrote you a letter. Uh, for my request, right. Uh, I forgot I wrote this. Uh, I am social distancing and enjoying getting the chance to play video games I've been putting off. What is something you've been doing to make isolation fun for yourself? Uh, let's open N's letter. Enjoying some quality time with my BF. Reading, writing, also working from home is so much more enjoyable than the office. <laughs> Stay safe, K-N. Let's say thanks with a sticker, shall we? I like the trouser fish. I think that's funny. Sending your thanks now. Done. I'll bet they love the sticker. I hope so. Okay, next from T. Just bought this, lol. Right on. From S. More or less the same, friend. I play D&D, so it's giving me more time to flesh out my world and characters that I've made. Hey, that's a great idea. It's nice to do. Would like to get out more, though, but sadly can't, given what's happening right now. I wonder what fun games you've been, you've been playing. Love from a friend, S. Well, thank you, S. You get an astronaut. Thank you, sticker. How about that? Aw, I like that sticker a lot, too. And from B, let's see what B has to say. Ooh, mug, 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 mug. <laughs> I'm playing video games too. I started and finished Ori and the Blind Forest, and now I'm starting Ori and the Will of the Wisps. Both are very good games. Yeah, I hear that uh, the sequel is more of the same, but way better. So, right on. Um, Ori. Do we have anything Ori related? I don't want to give this because I think this is just like the default first sticker you get. Uh, you're exploring. You get an astronaut. How about that? Right on. Okay. Oh, and we have one more. Personally, I've been working on art projects. That is another great idea. I've been beating myself up over not creating anything proper for a while now that I find... Uh, uh, uh. I've been beating myself up over not creating anything proper for a while, but now that I finally have time to, I've found that I still can. Well, that's, it's awesome. I really do think that art is something you can always return to, and you'll find that you really haven't lost much ground if you haven't been practicing for a while. That and regular calls with online friends through Discord. They're nice too. Right on. I love that. You also get an astronaut. <laughs> okay, so... Oh, someone sends their thanks for the letter you wrote with a tr another trouser fish sticker. So, um, decorate. Okay, that's just. Oh, can we actually put stickers in our room? Pop can show. Oh, cool. Right on, kitten plunk. They go in certain spaces. I see. Oh, but that doesn't look like a kitten. That's like a koala? Oh, I guess it's a cat. Uh, Blobfish, it's always his birthday. Aw. Good boy. Captain Astronaut, long before his last hurrah. Oh, right on. Mug, 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 mug. Yeah, we need the mug. Where does the trouser fish go, I wonder? Oh, up there? <laughs> I love that. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five stickers that we don't have yet. 
Um, before we dive into uh, viewing requests, let's read one of these. Keep in touch with your loved ones. It could make their day to hear about you. Oh, I think that is totally the truth. Okay, uh, view requests. Here we go, let's find a good one, shall we? I enjoy talking with my friend and always try to spend every free time I had with her. However, I'm afraid that it's just a one-time thing and I don't want it to sacrifice the relationship we had. Being a female myself makes it even harder to say it. Uh, talking to my friend. It's just a one-time thing. Hmm. You know, I think that the, like, grammar is making it hard for me to, under to wrap my head around that. Um, sorry about that. What do you guys like to do to relax? I play games, build my own Lego MOCs, draw, color, and to float around in a swimming pool. These are all great suggestions on what to do right now, especially whenever we're all in isolation. Let's see another one. Sometimes I have a hard time understanding that I am different. I feel like I'm too weird and that everyone hates me for it. I feel embarrassed every time I make a joke because no one gets my humor. I know I should be myself, it's just so... Well, we're gonna reply to this one. I think yes. Okay, hard time understanding that I'm different. I feel like I'm too weird and that everyone hates me for it. I feel embarrassed every time I make a joke because no one gets my humor. I know I should be myself, it's just so... Okay. Um... Okay, I was gonna say something that I don't think I believe. <laughs> so let's not do that. Let's let's be honest with our kind words, shall we? Um, and by the way, this music is awesome. I really do like this. This is such a relaxing and fun experience. I would love to do this every day. Okay. Being yourself is one of the most important things that any of us can do. All of the things that make, um, uh, how about this? Even though it can feel uh, what am I trying to say here? Even though it can feel, I guess, kind of like lonely because people, even though it can feel like you're misunderstood, everything that makes you, you, is... Uh, even though it can feel like you're misunderstood, everything that makes you you is the most everything is or everything are yeah everything is the most everything that makes you you is the most important and special thing. Does that sound trite? Being yourself is one of the most important things that any of us can do. Even though it can feel like you're misunderstood, everything that makes you you is the most important and special thing. Uh, I'm not sure that the grammar is correct in that sentence, but we're gonna go with it anyway. And then finally I'm going to say, you are the only one that can bring your special brand of being to the world. Thanks for Contributing. Mm, that sounds weird, I think. You're the only one that can bring your special brand of being to the world. That's a gift. Oops. There we go. Oh, and we can add stickers now. Uh, listen, if anyone gets it, it's trouser fish. Pantfish, whatever it's called. 
Thank you for taking the time uh, to think about a stranger. I'll rush this right over. I knew you'd keep writing, people. I'm sure they'll love this. Oh, hey, I discovered Connector 1 this morning. I was a bit stressed about some things, but I put this on loop and washed all that away. Hopefully, I'll have another sweet track for you tomorrow. Oh, right on. We got a new music track or something. Okay. Let's see here. Um, that seems like an issue. I don't really know what to say. I've been home for 15 days straight. Wow, it's starting to be rough. It must have been horrible in Wuhan. I feel so sorry for people in Iran. I wonder how they manage without hospitals. This thing is serious. Please take precautions. Cheers from Italy. Yeah. Let's reply. Um... I love that this game is connecting us across the sea. Let's see here. I think that saving energy is a new form of productivity. Um, 15 days straight is a lot. Keep it up. It's all worth it. And thanks for the encouragement there we go uh, I love that this game is connecting us across the sea I think that saving energy is a new form of productivity 15 days straight is a lot keep it up it's all worth it thanks for the encouragement um yeah I'm gonna send a cat face I still think that that looks kind of like a koala but yeah Thank you for taking the time to think about a stranger. I'll rush this right over. You can count on me to deliver this letter. Well, thank you. I am being... Okay, this is another issue about ghosting. COVID-19 really do be keeping me in quarantine. I don't have it. It's just I'm bored out my mind at home and just wanted to ask how y'all's day has been. Yeah, let's reply to this. This is from O. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I know staying indoors for extended periods like this sure is tough. The good news is I think it's tough for all of us. Why is that good news? <laughs> it reminds me that we are all in this together. Um, strange how we can feel so connected even through such a tumul tumultuous time. Is that how you spell, spell tumultuous? Tumultuous. Yes. Oh no, I forgot a U? Tumultuous, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I thought that looked wrong. <laughs> Yeah, I know staying indoors for extended periods like this sure is tough. The good news is, I think it's tough for all of us. Why is that good news? It reminds me that we are all in this together. Strange how we can feel so connected even through such a tumultuous time. And... Astronaut. Thank you for taking the time to think about a stranger. I'll rush this over right now. You can count on me to deliver this letter. 
G'day folks, hope y'all doing good. No special request, just sending all the love. Wash your hands. Good reminder. I don't feel comfortable, my birth gender, female, and I don't feel non-binary or male. I don't like any label beside androgynous or trans mask, but I don't want to have to look androgyn. I want to present however I want. I think mostly mask. Help. Uh, let's see here. Sounds like you are between a lot of hard options. I say hard because they seem to be defined by other people. Oops, what happened there? By other people. Because they seem to be uh, concretely defined by other people. It can feel good to be a part of an identifiable group. You can get strength and support from them. Uh, I don't claim to have specific answers to your request, but I encourage you to Keep being yourself in all ways. Let's see. Keep being yourself or I encourage you to keep being the fullest expression of yourself. Okay, I gotta wrap this up here. Um, cause I'm, it says 10 of 14 lines used. Uh, uh, I don't claim to have specific answers to your request, but I encourage you to keep being the fullest expression of yourself. Even if that expression doesn't fit any preconceived molds. Okay, what did I say? She, uh, they said, I don't feel comfortable my birth gender, female, and I don't feel non-binary or male. I don't like any label besides androgynous or trans mask, but I don't want to have to look androgyny. I want to present however I want. I think mostly mask. Help. And I said, sounds like you are between a lot of hard options. I say hard because they seem to be concretely defined by other people. It can feel good to be a part of an identifiable group. You can get strength and support from them. I don't claim to have specific answers to your request, but I encourage you to keep being the fullest expression of yourself, even if that expression doesn't fit any preconceived molds. Um, and I think uh, once again, Pants Fish understands. Thank you for taking the time to think about a stranger. I'll rush this right over. You can count on me to deliver this letter. Okay. I've been severely abused by people with NPD my whole life, causing me to develop CP, TSD, and BPD. So, let's see here. What does NPD mean? I think BPD is bipolar disorder. I don't know what CPTSD, I know what PTSD is. Um, I have a fear of antisocial... Oh, you know, I don't know what this... I don't know what NPD or PD is. Oh, personality disorder? Yeah, I have absolutely no uh, uh, claim to expertise in that area, unfortunately. When I'm stressed, sad, or down in general, I tend to buy like five $100 packs from free-to-play games I'll never play again after a week because doing that makes me feel good despite being too poor for it. Not doing it makes me feel worse. I didn't understand the question. Sometimes I feel like a dumbass. I used to have an online BF that I sent 
pictures to, uh-huh. And he sent pics back. My parents found out and now they don't trust me anymore. He forced me into the relationship by pressuring me to do it and send pics. Ugh. All right, let's see here. I did a few things sort of similar when I was still living with my mom. Um, having a parent, uh, I guess they're saying parents, so having your parents tell you that they've lost trust in you is frustrating and um yeah is is frustrating having your parents tell you that they've lost trust in you is frustrating the good news is in many cases Their trust can be earned again, even if they say it can't. Sometimes time really does heal those relationships. And Although being patient sucks sometimes, uh, sometimes time really does heal those relationships, and although being patient sucks sometimes, um, uh, I was gonna say something like they're still your family, but I don't think that applies. There's a few things sort of similar when I was living with my mom and your parents tell you the last trusting you is frustrating. The good news is in many cases their trust can be again, even the state can't. Sometimes time really does heal those relationships and all of them patients suck sometimes. I think it'll pay off in the long run. Best to you and your parents. Um, okay, so they said, sometimes I feel like a dumbass. I used to have an online BF that I sent pictures to, and he sent pics back. My parents found out, and now they don't trust me anymore. He forced me into the relationship by pressuring me to do it and send pics. Ugh, okay. So I said, I did a few things sort of similar when I was still living with my mom. Having your parents tell you that they've lost trust in you is frustrating. The good news is in many cases their trust can be earned again, even if they say it can't. Sometimes time really does heal those relationships, and although being patient sucks sometimes, I think it'll pay off in the long run. Plus, it sounds like... Um... It sounds like... Uh, uh, let's see. Plus, it sounds like you know now that person uh, uh, is not a great guy. Does that sound good? I think it'll pay off in the long run. Plus, it sounds like you know now that Plus, it sounds like you know now that person is not a great guy. Best to you and your parents. Cat. Thank you for taking the time to think about a stranger. I'll rush this right over. You can count on me to deliver this letter. There we go. Oh, okay, this, this, this is a good one. I struggle from body dysmorphic disorder and lately I've gained a lot of weight, mostly from depression. Every time I look in the mirror, I see something I don't want to see. I hate having to look at my body all the time. It stresses me out. All right. Um, let's see here. How can I say this? 
when I was struggling with body dysmorphia, I found that, um, let's see here, training myself to not look in the mirror unless I had to, you know, um, I found that training myself to not look in the mirror became a habit of not looking in the mirror. The less I focused on my body and how it looked, the more I focused on the aspects of myself Uh, uh, like, well, the more I focused on the aspects of myself I could be truly proud of. I also realized that I didn't want the kind of pride, I didn't want to, I didn't want to feel the kind of pride that only comes from my appearance. I wanted a deeper pride in myself. Does that make sense? When I was struggling with body dysmorphia, I found that training myself to not look in the mirror, unless I had to, you know, became a habit of not looking in the mirror. Became a habit. Uh, I want to capitalize this, but I think it'll sound like I'm yelling. Oh, but I capitalize not, so why not? I found that training myself to not look in the mirror, unless I had to, you know, became a habit of not looking in the mirror. The less I focused on my body and how it looked, the more I focused on the aspects of myself I could be truly proud of. I also realized that I didn't want to feel the kind of pride that only comes from my appearance. I wanted a deeper pride in myself. Good news! I can look in the mirror today and not be destroyed by what I see. There is hope! There we go. So they said, I struggle from body dysmorphic disorder and lately I've gained a lot of weight mostly from depression. Every time I look in the mirror, I see someone I don't want to see. I hate having to look at my body all the time, it stresses me out. And I said, when I was struggling with body dysmorphia, I found that training myself to not look in the mirror, unless I had to, you know, became a habit of not looking in the mirror. The less I focused on my body and how it looked, the more I focused on the aspects of myself I could be truly proud of. I also truly, I could be deep, deeply proud of or truly proud of, ah, truly is fine. I also realized that I didn't want to feel the kind of pride that only comes from my appearance. Let me capitalize that. I wanted a deeper, man, this is like capitalization city, but uh, I hope it comes across in the spirit it's intended. I wanted a deeper pride in myself. Good news, I can look in the mirror today and not be destroyed by what I see. There is hope. And cat. Thank you for taking the time to think about a stranger. I'll rush this right over. I've got to say, friends, this is one of the best games I have ever played. And this is just the second time I played it. And it seems like this is the only, all there is to it. Um, I, it's $4.99 on Steam, and you can play it from your computer, so you don't have to have a console or a Switch or anything like that. In fact, I don't think you can play it on the Switch, because, I mean, can you imagine having to try to input whole letters via that? No, anyway. Um, so I suggest everyone get this, especially right now in isolation, when we're self-isolating, because you really do feel encouraged, and uh, by focusing on other people, you can forget um, uh, yourself a little bit. And uh, that is um, 
so important right now and the benefits are immeasurable. Um, anyway, thanks a lot for watching, friends. I'm excited to play this again. Uh, I think I'll play it again tomorrow. So, um, anyway, I guess I'll see you, friends, tomorrow then. Uh, thanks a lot for watching. I have been and I'll continue to be Kip Icon as long as you guys continue to follow your drams. Bye!